Hello and welcome to my in-video review where I'm going to be going over some of the features, giving you a demo, and of course talking about the pros and cons at the end to help you decide if it's going to be worth it and good for you to use overall. Before I get started, I do want to let you know a big pro when it comes to this software is they do come with a free plan which allows you to kind of test them out and see how much you like them yourself. I will leave that link in the description in case you'd like to do that, follow along, or just for your own enjoyment. Let's begin. Right off the bat, something I really noticed quickly about this is that NVIDIA is just a host of so many templates and a lot of different uses, niches, businesses. So regardless of what you're doing, you're probably gonna have an easy time finding something that you're looking for. Whether you're a YouTube creator, just a creator in general, you wanna create TikTok and Instagram videos, whether you have a different type of business, online or offline, this really works well for a lot of different businesses. Something I've noticed a lot, they even do a lot of offline ones, like real estate is very big. I've noticed they even have similar ones like when it comes to photography when it comes to wedding doing slideshow presentations and as you can see if you look at some of these here a lot of them are going to be new so they're constantly adding new templates to it which is a great thing if you're looking for something maybe like a youtube intro or an outro they have plenty of those very easy to do let's click on uh, intro youtube right here and what I like about the templates the best is not only do they have a lot of them it's the fact that they're very easy to edit for an example, if you wanted to do an intro like this, you'd probably look for something where you like the colors, maybe like the transitions. And then once you do that, editing it becomes very easy. I like this retro one. It reminds me of uh, like kind of like Miami back in the day. And they're gonna have all this done for you. We can change around the text. And of course, you would just add in your logo and text placeholder. So it's gonna make your life a lot easier. I've done many videos talking about that specifically. So I'm not gonna go in and edit it, but that's something I really like. And I think you're gonna really like as well. They also have like YouTube outros as well, similar to the uh, intro. Let's do outro here. Let's do outro YouTube. I've done videos on this as well. I, I believe I use this one here with Marketing Island. It has the island in the background, but once again, I like that it's tailored to me. It's something I can use, and that's what you'd wanna look for in terms of the type, of, say, YouTube channel that you have. That's just scratching the surface when it comes to this. As you can see, there's going to be a lot of different types of aspect ratios, types, and industries that you can search for within that. And landscape's pretty much gonna be like anything for YouTube. Then you have square and portrait is more gonna be like Instagram and TikTok. So right off the bat, a lot of templates for a lot of niches and a lot of different businesses. In fact, if I click off this right here, it doesn't say the total amount, but there's going to be a lot starting with suggested and kind of quickly scrolling through, you can see that there's a lot going on. Now, even better than the templates is the ability to create videos. And what I like the best about this specifically is going to be their text to video or script to video. I think this is an is a fantastic feature. It's gonna be great for any type of marketing, whether it's affiliate marketing, promoting your own products, offers, or services, or just creating valuable videos, say like listicles or like the top best reasons for X, Y, and Z. Let me show you how it works specifically. So this is where you convert your scripts into engaging videos. They have some templates here and something I wanna remind you of that I've talked about in my previous videos is that just because this is based upon retail and this is a general business video, doesn't mean you can't use these. For these specific templates, you're looking for say like the uh, the text style here with the background in it. Like I like this one because it has the uh, dark background with the light text, so that's gonna work very well. And if you scroll up a little bit more, these types of videos will only have like the video where it's shown, like the video will only be here. So I don't like that type. Just kind of giving you some tips as going through. So I like this one, self-help video. Like I said, just because it's self-help doesn't mean we can't use it for golf or cooking or online business. Let's go with that. Let's use our template. And here's the really cool part. So you can add your own script here, which I'm going to do, or you can add your own URL. So if you already have an article, you can paste it in there and do it that way, or you can add media files if you want. What I'm gonna do is paste in this article that I've already got and copied down here. And let's call this, let's add in our headline. Normally you'd probably want to do a little bit longer, you know, but it's fine. And what you can do is just click on next. If you had some like mismatching when it comes to spacing, it'll help you do that. But it will also auto suggest images and videos for each of these sections. Let's click on next. Okay, and as you can see, what it did is automatically create kind of like slides for us where it has images here. And of course the text that's going to be there. Uh, not all of them are gonna be related, but that's fine. I'll show you how you can edit them. Some aren't going to have any images. And if your text is too long, it'll suggest like splitting. But for now, I'm just gonna keep it out as so we can continue on with that. 
By catering to a niche market, you can be more successful in terms of both marketing and sales, uh, building a strong online presence. So as you can see, it created specific slides. And what we can do is change each and every one of these in terms of what it looks like. Okay, so three tips for building your online business. Let's go with a image here and let's just do business. And they are a host of just so many different types of images, both images and videos that you can utilize. It's going to be up to you. As you can see with iStock, there's only going to be so many that you can use with your paid plan. I'll talk about that more as we go on. But let's just say I wanted to use this. I would drag it here. And it might be a little bit blurry in the beginning. That's fine. As you render, it gets better. So don't worry too much about that. Let's just say niche. What you want to do a little tip is that anytime you're going to look for a picture or background here, use some type of keyword. Okay. So niche is kind of hard to, you know, really get an image for, but something like this seems like it could do well. Okay. A little bit more cartoony. One of the best tips for building an online business is find a niche market. So once again, this is going to be related. I like something like this where it's focusing on a specific niche. I guess you could look at it that way. Okay. A niche market is a group of people with specific needs. Okay, I feel like the word niche isn't great for finding uh, images, so let's do a strong online presence. Let's just do like social media, something like that. Okay, social media, social media. This looks cool, I like this. All right, someone where like they're, you know, everywhere, they're omnipresent, uh, strong online presence, that's kind of repetitive. It means having a website. Let's do website. Okay, so that'll be our keyword for this one. Okay, stock photos, stock photos. Just something simple like this could do the trick. And I know I'm using a lot of images, so let's change it up and actually go to video. So we can go to video here. And what I want to do, I just want to show you some of the other different types of media that are going to be on here. Like, uh, let's just go with, let's see, vacation. Just to give you an idea, I know it's not related to like internet marketing or business, but I want to give you an idea of what they have to offer for media, whether it's going to be video. Uh, some of these are absolutely just gorgeous. Say it doesn't have to match up with offer something unique. We're going to trim this video to fit the scene. Kind of looks like Miami there. Let's click on that and do done. Okay. Offer something unique. I'm just going to throw a few more in here. This looks great. Someone surfing. I know it's not related, but once again, just some more examples. And what do we have at the end? By standing out, you'll make more sales. So there you have it, our top tips for building an online business. We hope this video has given you a good place to start. We can do dot, dot, dot. If this is what it's gonna look like if you split it up. So let's do yes. So it's gonna be two different slides. So the words aren't gonna be as you know uh, small. There we go. If you're looking more for helping getting started, check out the uh, video course and starting an online business. You can say like, look in the description and so on and so forth. So overall, that's how you go about creating a process when it comes to using the text to video. You can do much more of it when it comes to the advanced editor. Let's check that out quickly. Okay, and so we have each of the slides. Keep in mind, I didn't add pictures and text to all of them. It's kind of just quickly going through it to you know show you how it works. I do have plenty of other videos in case you wanna see more demos. There is a section for media in terms of audio. However, uh, in case you didn't see my previous videos, I changed computers and I didn't get to edit around my mic. I can hear the sound, but you can't. So it's gonna be much harder for me to talk, you know, and you're not gonna be able to hear anyway. So I'm just gonna... And what we can do is actually add voiceovers. This is a cool little feature as well. So we have like three tips for building online business. We can do automated text to speech. You can import from your uploads. You can upload it or just record it like I'm doing. So if I was gonna record this, I could say three tips for building your online business. And then we would go to the next one. But if we just wanna use automated text to speech it's gonna have it for us right here and there's gonna be a few voices I'm not gonna say like they're the best in the world given the fact I've tested a lot of uh, uh, text-to-speech voices but they'll get the job done so we could do generate voiceover and we can preview and then add it and of course it would go right about here so we can also do a voiceover at the same time which is really cool Something else you could do is any type of animations if you want. You could also change the duration of each. Maybe one's gonna be a little bit longer. Maybe one's gonna be a little bit shorter. Also, I just noticed this. I don't need a specific logo there, so I'm gonna delete from all scenes. But let me kind of just go towards where some of the images were. I'm gonna go right here. This is the video, so this one's gonna look a little bit better. Remember, this was just putting that there, and it will show up a little like blurry. Like I said, when you render, it looks great. <laughs> just another video and going on. 
So that's the type of video that you can create. What I like about it, like I said before, the fact that you can just leverage so many templates is gonna make your life so much easier. You don't have to worry about a lot of the transitions. You can, of course, change them around. You can add in your voiceovers, but it's gonna make it a much quicker process in order from going you know, from having text or a script and turning that into a video. And that's probably, in my opinion, one of the best features that comes along with this. Speaking of that, there's just so many different types of templates that I talked about before. Moving into the pros and cons of this, uh, let's talk about those templates. There's a lot of them, and I even have a list here in case you're curious about what those templates come with. So let me read them off when it comes to templates. You have slideshow, advertisements, memes, holidays, collage videos, wedding videos, technology videos, YouTube, birthday, business, travel, greetings, social media, real estate, long video templates, short video templates, fashion, music, gaming, marketing, food and restaurant, outro videos, education videos, intro videos, animated templates, promo video templates, and of course, invitation templates. With in those there are a ton to choose from and with that what i also like as i talked about before they do have their free plan and their pricing is pretty good if you ask me it starts off at zero dollars which is just going to be for testing it out it has free video sharing but i don't believe you can actually export it like i said it's great for getting the hang of it and seeing like is this going to be perfect for me plus you don't even need a card with a pre free plan so that's also something that's really great and of course, when we talk about the text to video, it's just fantastic. I think it's a pretty simple process. There are going to be a little bit of learning to it, like it does have a little learning curve. But once you get going, uh, it's pretty simple to do. You type in your text, you space it out right, and you look for those main keywords that are going to go with the main point. And that's where you can meet and match kind of the videos or the images that you use when it comes to creating your videos. And then of course, on the other side, there's the pros and the cons, the likes, the dislikes. I didn't find really too much that I didn't like about this. There is one thing I do want to bring up. And if we scroll down, once you get to the actual business or unlimited, the paid plans, this is where you can use a lot of the premium media. However, it's very limited in my opinion. I would love to see if it was a little bit higher. So when it comes to the uh, watermark free videos, if you get the free plan, the videos are going to be watermark free. It's only the premium media that will come with a watermark. So that's something to keep in mind. But once you do upgrade, you only get 10 per month. And in my opinion, that's not a whole lot, given the fact that some of those like uh, iStock medias are just so beautiful, whether it's the images or pictures and how that works. Let's say you use two of them in your video and you go to export, it's gonna deduct from those 10 per month. Then of course, at the end of the month, it refreshes. Of course, if you did want more, it would be 120. I I just feel like 10 could be a little bit higher. That's probably like my one nitpick when it comes to this. Uh, video exports is still gonna be great. For the business plan, you get 60 a month. That's on average two videos a day. So if you're planning on doing 60 or less, like business would be great for you. And if you want more unlimited, you know, that's great. You get an unlimited amount. So that's probably the one nitpick when I have in terms of in video. I think it works great. I think there was one time where it just took a little bit longer to load. I refreshed it and everything was good. But aside from that, it does exactly what it talks about. It has a free plan and it's great. It's just phenomenal when it comes to turning text or scripts into a video where a lot of the transitions are done for you and you just got to add in the appropriate media and so on and so forth. So is in video worth it? Is it good? Yeah, definitely. If, if you're looking to create videos, if you want a text to speech creator, if you want just a ton of templates that'll help you through the process so you don't have to stare at a, a blank screen and wonder, how do I create my video? What do I do next? Then yeah, give it a try. I think you'll really like it. So that concludes my in-video review. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment down below. I will do my best to answer. Once again, I do have that link in the description in case you want to try them out for free. They have the free plan, which you can see right in front of me. And that should just about do it. My name is James. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video.